Welcome to Big Happy Day. Enjoy multiple videos every day with your favorite yoga teachers. Check out these videos for your daily dose of happiness and inspiration. Tune in and please share the videos. Everyone deserves to have a big happy day. Hi, I'm Beau Forbes. I'm a clinical psychologist, yoga teacher, and yoga therapist. And I am happy to be here today with you to talk about another infrastructure intervention. Today we'll be focusing on the core body, our source of gut wisdom, and our central intelligence agency. To back up a little bit, infrastructure interventions are those tools that we add to our practice to make our practice more therapeutic. So it doesn't matter so much what kind of yoga practice you do, but how you practice that counts. Today's infrastructure intervention focuses on the core body. We tend to think of the core body as our abdominals. But there's more to the core body than meets the eye or the abdomen. The core body is the location of our enteric nervous system, which is our belly brain. This enteric nervous system, many of us didn't even realize we had, has 100 million neurons, which is more even than the spinal cord has. It takes direction from our central nervous system but it also acts on its own. It has its own intelligence and awareness. There is a very strong link between the enteric nervous system, our central nervous system, and our immune system. So the nervous and immune systems actually participate in establishing a defensive barrier for our gut. In addition, there's a connection to emotional issues as well. So people with a high incidence of childhood trauma also have uh, digestive anomalies. The gut also makes its own serotonin, which has a powerful influence on mood. In fact, the gut serotonin system is so complex and intricate that it actually contains seven different kinds of serotonin receptors. From this, we also know that uh, the gut has a strong influence on emotional issues such as anxiety and depression. And as if all this weren't enough, the gut also manufactures its own opiates, its own endorphins, which help protect us against pain. So the enteric nervous system is deeply connected to nervous system balance, emotional regulation, and immunity and health. So in order to train our core in a deep and integrated way, we need to be able to engage our core and to release our core when engagement isn't necessary, and most of all, to generate awareness in our core body. Thank you for joining me today to talk about your enteric nervous system. I hope I've given you some food for thought for thinking about the incredible importance of your center. Namaste.